is happening in here? Why is there so much fog? Seriously, where did this fog come from? I'm fuming. I can't see a thing. This is not funny. Ah, uh, yes. Pokemon Blue and Pokemon Red. How could I have forgotten? Yes, yes, I'm getting around to it all today. We're doing the Sword and Shield Elite Trainer Boxes. I kind of dig the gold reflective bit there. That's fancy. So, each of these, I think, has eight booster packs in them. I also saw people commenting in one of my videos saying, what's all that white stuff that Max got on his fingers? I can assure you, no funny business. I only just realized I'm getting more now. It's coming off the wrapper. It's coming off the wrapper is probably also something you'd hear about the other white stuff. Now, the first thing you're gonna see when we slide this out is a player's guide. Now, there's a funny little trick you can do with these. If you open them up to about the middle, you get just the right angle, you can get enough velocity to hurl it straight into the trash. I came here to play card games, not read! I'm liking what you're doing with the gold, but don't overdo it. You're walking a thin line at the moment. All right, let's pop this bad boy open. What is this? Some mustard color fluffing cardboard. We have some sleeves for your deck. We've got some dividers. We have a code. We've got some dice. We have a poison and burn resin counter, a 45 stack of energy. And last and most importantly of all, we've got a bunch of sword and shield booster packs. These elite trainer boxes are quite boring, but you gotta remember you also get this pretty funky box to keep your cards in, so that's something. All right, let's test our luck and see how it fares with the trainer box. We have a code one, two, three, to the front, getting rid of the Psychic Energy. We've got a Pokemon Catcher, a Durizar, we've got Evolution Incense, Clobberpuss, Wooloo, Sobble, we've got uh, Blipbug Volpix, very cute Volpix there. Have I seen that before? Looks like it's running down a Minecraft staircase. Uh, and then on the very end, we're gonna start pretty strong with a Professor's Research. It's a good start. That was a decent pack. Is there any big boy Pokemon in this box, we've got a fair crack at it with eight packs. One, two, three, to the front, getting rid of the fire energy. We have a Salazzle into a Bishop, Pokemon Catcher, Ghastly, Pornyard, Sizzler P. We've got the Queen's Corgi, and then we've got an Octopus wearing boxing gloves, a sand eating snake. I hate these reverses. On the end, what? What? No way! Okay! Trainer box might be overpowered, boys. Okay, that is, that's made my day. That is just, what a fantastic start. I don't know what to say. That was just so unexpected. Okay. This damn hot dog. dog. Metal Saucer, Golden. Professor Magnolia into Golden Metal Saucer. First two packs. All right, we're gonna select this one. We're gonna go for the Shield Dog. And we're gonna see if it's even possible to get anything else. This might be just like completely unrest oh, unrestrained luck. You could maybe just get anything from an Elite Trainer Box. I don't know, maybe there's a cap on it, but I don't think so since the actual booster box, they have to have some sort of mapping, like an order of things. There's a Snom into a Frost Moth, okay. Another holographic at least. We're on three for three packs here. All right. Can we get, how many of these are the shield dog? I feel like we've been doing a lot of shield dogs. Oh, it was a shield dog box, right. Okay, Mr. Shield Dog, show us what you're made of. We have the baby little sand eating snake there. There is the code, one, two, three to the front, getting rid of the water. We got a big fat berry. We've got a bird, we've got a monkey, we've got a snake, we've got a bug, we've got a fish, we've got a dog, we have a Scorpion couldn't think of the real life animal. I'm struggling. There is a fish on the end We're going to drop this streak short on number four with just a regular old clay doll Lapras Let's see you big fat ass. Let's see what you got Please, please have a ton of junk in your trunk. Ho 
hopefully holographic junk. Three to the front. We're going to get rid of the grass, haunter, monkey, sloot, money. Money reverse? Is money good? I don't know. There's a reverse money though. And then on the end, yeah, these ones are just going to be duds, I reckon. Thievil. Honestly though, reverse money. I think that's another good pack. Okay, another Lapras. Three more oh, packs to go. That one has opened up easy. There is the code one, two, three to the front, getting rid of grass. Sado, what are what you doing? Loitering? You know, that's a crime. Joltic, snake, fish. <laughs> Another metal saucer. I will take it. A reverse metal saucer. And on the end, we've got another holographic. This is, um, this is a good box, I'll tell you that. Also, Obstagoon. One of the better holographics. All right, two packs to go. I'm going to finish with the shield dog. So, oh yeah, we're getting the hang of it. I forgot how to open them. There we go. So we're going to open the lapis. One, two, three to the front, getting rid of the steel energy. All right, Drizzile. We've got Evolution Incense. Okay. We've got a Salazzle. We've got a Sobble, Maractus, Mudbray, Pornyard, Score Bunny, Baltoy as our reverse. Very uh, end. What was that B? Okay. Wasn't aware this was a thing. This box is fire. I mean, it's psychic, but it's I, it's good. I like it. I really like it. That's got an interesting reflective surface there. It's like I've spilt a glass of milk on the table, and these are like the dry patches. Waba Fett, everyone. <laughs> I swear to God, if this is also something, man, I'm going to guess that this is going to be just a regular non-holographic. All right, here we go. There is code one, two, three. There is... Electric energy th or thunder. We've got a stun fisk. Don't step on those guys. We've got a hop, Mincino, Mincino, Meowth, Score Bunny, Galarian Obstagoon as our reverse. Very end cut! You have got to be joking! <laughs> I don't. How? How? Please, I don't. This is, this is real. I don't know if, if it's possible to fake, but. Is this possible to get this good shit in a booster elite trainer box? I can't believe it. This is better luck than I had over like two or three boxes of cards. Team Yell, Grunt, Rainbow, Secret Version, number 210 of 202. As a, like a product for an elite trainer box, there's no way I've ever opened something that lucky. I remember having some pretty good luck from one of the, uh, like, cosplay Pikachu boxes or something like that. But I don't think I remember it being on this level. Please, guys, share this video. It's not too often I like to clickbait the card that I get in it, so I'm just going to keep the thumbnail uh, still just showing the two Elite Trainer boxes. So I depend on you guys to spread the word of my luck. That is fantastic. And here is the Player's Guide, except this time... It's red and still in the trash. Okay, pop the top, get rid of the mustard box. Can you imagine if in this one, yeah, so this one has the sword, dog, sh oh no, sword, dog, shield, dog. All right, it was just a coincidence that we got a bunch of shield dogs in the other one. Different colored dice and counters, deck sleeves, pack of energy, and of course, here is the dividers. Here is a code card with the last three digits hidden. I will give away one more of those digits uh, going forward in this same video at some point. Here is the code. One, two, three, to the front. All right, let's see if we can have similar luck with this one. Maybe all of these elite trainer boxes are just unnecessarily blessed. I guess we'll find out. And if I get something absurd in this box, I may have to buy a couple more of these suckers. I, I, okay, am I, I'm in a dream maybe? I might, I think maybe I'm, I'm dreaming. Well, there you go guys, just buy the Elite Trainer Boxes, they pay for themselves. Uh, also, you can unglue this part of the box for a nice little secret. Um, apparently some people like to hang this on their wall for some reason. Alright, surely the luck is ex ex exhausted, it's been... It, this has to be just some regular shit now, the rest of these. Please. 
give me something good though. I, I mean, no, don't please give me dog shit. I'll take anything though. I am very, very grateful. There is a Pikachu end card Rapidash. Okay, non-holographic. That's what I thought. Sword dog. What's it gonna be if I can even open it? All right, here we go. From the top, like so, we've got the code. Then we have one, two, three to the front, getting rid of the steel slash metal. We got a Jesus egg. We've got Mantine. We've got a big hammer. We've got Bell Toy, Wooloo. I don't feel like crushing my brains with the big hammer today, folks. We've got a Poker Kid reverse. I'm having a great day. Uh, another Frost Mob, but you know, holographic, I'll take you. After this, maybe we can get some drinks, do a little ice dance to celebrate. I think I might, like, because both of these boxes have now had something good in them. I think I'm going to have to maybe test the waters and try again with just, like, another Elite Trainer box. BD, regular, don't need ya. Could someone actually tell me how to pronounce his name? Have they actually said it audibly in, like, the anime yet or anything? Is Or a short? I know they released some shorts recently. Poltergeist into, all right, regular shit. I'm sure someone knows. BD, but I, I've been calling him BD and Bay Day and sometimes Beyblade. I'm going to be really bummed if you pronounce it like bead. Don't worry, guys. I'm just killing imps looking for the red bead. Snorlax! What's it going to be from you, pal? Here we go. One, two... Off. <laughs> Here we have a Poker Kid. Energy Search, Team Yell Grunt, don't need any more of those regular forms. Got the big, amazing rainbow. We've got a Quillfish into the... All right, yep, okay. This is how things should be. But I've got an inkling. I'm, I'm kind of half expecting to just see something crazy again. We've got three more packs to make it happen. The luck is on my side today. It's, it's possible. There is the code card, one, two, three, to the front, getting rid of the fighting... Energy, we've got a Ferrothorn, we've got a Raboot, we've got a Lumberry, we've got a Rookie D, we've got a Sizzlipede, Snom, Morwile, a Yampart. This doesn't make sense! This is a very expensive card as well! I don't get it! This shouldn't be possible! How it... I, I feel like this... No one's gonna believe that this is happening. Like, authentically. The, are these not the two most expensive trainers you can get in a set? Or item trainers, at least? I... <laughs> this... I am, I am in actual shock. I, I feel like there's some degree to this thing that people are going to think somehow I've planned this, or... I don't know. I don't... I don't understand. This, this can't happen. Are these just going to all go down in price when people realize that the elite trainer boxes have just been purposely stacked or something? Am I busting this thing wide open? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never in my life have I been this lucky with op This is, this is, there's no way. That shouldn't be possible. We, <laughs> we have two more packs to go. I'm gonna go with a Lapras. Can you imagine if it just happened again? Or there's like even a V card in this, I would just claim as being, it, it couldn't be possible. Three to the front, getting rid of fire energy. Imagine if you just got two golds in one box or something like that, or another rainbow. Sorry, I basically did that. I got a rainbow and a gold in one box. Is it po oh, I really thought for a second that reverse was something else. All right, here we go. Uh, Dreadnor, just regular. I'm in shock. I'm sorry, I keep saying that. I mean, today, it could be the day we get that Charizard in the Burning Shadows. Can you imagine that? After all this, this is the episode. Here's the next digit for the card. I'm going to leave the last two up for guessing so people can try to take some more time and someone else can get it rather than just the early birds. And before we open the last pack, it's time for Bats Mofos Boost Card Collection! Today, we're opening one that we have already seen. There you go, just a repeat. Now, moving on to the Burning Shadows. Burning Shadows. We're going to open up a, another three pack here. We're just going to pull this sucker out. Are you the Charizard? Please be the Charizard. Tangela. We have... I think I've already seen... Uh, did I just pull the end card off? Three to the front, getting rid of the electric energy. We've got a Surviper, uh, Sophocles, Rectangular Tynamo, Crab Roller, Inkay, Ladybug. We've got a Lost Charmander, 
into Malamar. All right, nothing to write home about there. Just a big old squid. Don't even care. I, I don't care. Charizard who? Da -da -da -da. Final pack for the episode. What's it going to be? Here is the code from the back. One, two, three to the front, getting rid of something. Uh, we have Steve Irwin's killer. We've got a crushing hammer. We've got switch. Baltoy. toy. We've got a sheep. There's that. There's this. There's hop as our reverse. And on the end, we're going to finish with just a regular Drampa. And Drampa? I hardly know her. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I don't, I don't know what just happened. Make sure you check out the latest Sword and Shield Let's Play. There is a new episode out. And if you would like to buy any of the Max Mofo merch, all this glorious merch, you can do that by clicking the link at the top of the description below or by going to max.shirts with a Z dot cool. And if you buy anything else from that website, make sure you use code MOFO to save 10%. And I will see you guys whenever I see you guys. I'm in a, I'm in a good mood. That, this, I, what, what, what? What happened? I blacked out. What happened?